Hey everyone, Steve here at the DJ Lab, taking a look at Rekordbox for iOS version 4.0. This is the new Rekordbox app, only on iOS, it's not on Android yet, unfortunately. And this app you can now use to DJ with on your phone. Now, I don't know why anybody would want to have a little app on their phone to DJ with. It's not something I would want to do, but what you can do with this thing, if you scroll down here, is um, you can hook this thing up to an FLX4, for instance, right? So you don't need a computer. And for some reason, if you have an iPad, I guess, and you got an FLX4, this might be an okay situation. I haven't tried it. I probably never will try it. I had an FLX4 here at the lab. Unfortunately, out of the box, it had issues with the, um, the color effects knob was engaging when it wasn't supposed to. But what did you expect? It's not very expensive, so you're going to probably have the odd one here or there that does have some manufacturing defect. That's just the way it is now in the year 2023, it seems. Um, you got support for streaming services off this little app, but it's SoundCloud and Tidal. I don't know why there's not BeatPort and BeatSource and everybody else, but that's all we have for now. Hopefully in the future, that's going to change. And you can hook this thing up, uh, what does it say? So, you can connect your iPhone, iPad to professional equipment such as a CDJ3000, the RX3, the XDJ, XZ, and use a hardware to play tracks saved in the Rekordbox mobile app. Plus, you can sync up to 10 tracks with your cloud-based Rekordbox library for free with Cloud Sync. So, they say for free. Here's my biggest problem with Pioneer. And I love Pioneer gear. You know me, I got lots of it. And I'm waiting for even more and I've been waiting a long time as well um, record box so just the record box program on a computer they want you to subscribe to get the extra things such as you know the, the record box cloud and all this other fun stuff and then with this app apparently it's free and on the FLX 4 it's free but if you want to start using it with anything else you got to pay or you get all these little pop-up ads all the time so Phil over at uh, Digital DJ Tips was doing his whole review on this thing, talk about how this thing kept trying to get money out of him, how Pioneer was taking every opportunity to get you to spend money. Thought it was kind of funny. He's not the kind of guy that typically, you know, tries to stick at the Pioneer. But in this case, you could see how irritated he was that this thing kept popping up things, wanting him to upgrade, wanting him to upgrade. And it's like 50 bucks a year. Seriously, Pioneer, are you that desperate for money that you need to nickel and dime everybody? I play Fortnite for free. Fortnite is forever changing. There's a lot of content. And I, I understand it's a video game versus DJ software. But, you know, if some of these companies can develop these huge games and let you play them for free, you should be able to develop a little tiny app, DJ app, and give it away for free because it's not the best app on an iPhone or a tablet. That DJ algorithm, I don't love it, but it's better and it has a few more options. You can do stems. So I don't know who this is for, but if you have an iPhone, I guess download it, try it. Me personally, I don't have an iPhone here, so I'm gonna have to wait until they release it for Android to try it out. But don't worry, I'm not holding my breath on it. It looks kind of like a toy. It doesn't look like something I'm going to need personally. Let me know what you think in the comments. Is this something you're looking forward to using? Have you tried it out? Is it worth it? Because from what I can see, this is nothing special, man. I've seen this a million times over from a bunch of different developers doing the same kind of thing. I will talk to you all soon.